Let's go, gamers. Who's ready? Well, you know who's ready. The sky. Do you see how dark it is in my room right now? It's the, it is storming so bad outside. Like, you can tell because it's so dark in here. It is really storming outside. <laughs> yeah, this is Simsy after dark, but it's 4 p.m. Um, so wish us luck. Uh, <laughs> hopefully we don't have any incidents with the, with the power and or internet or something. But um, yeah, the, the Florida has awoken this afternoon. Like normal, but maybe worse than normal. <laughs> So, I don't know. This is the thing, when we did the shell tours last time, we had, um, thunder. We had, like, a bunch of gallery problems. The gallery was kind of breaking. Um, and so, <laughs> hopefully we don't have any issues today. <laughs> um, but anyway, we're gonna do the shell tours today, which should be fun. You can all redeem your thingy right now if you want to. Um, same way as normal, we have, like, a point redemption in the chat. Make sure you give me your origin ID so that I can look you up on the gallery. Um, and then we'll, we'll do some tours. It should be fun. Um, I do have my game open. In fact, you know what? Let's just do a little check <laughs> really fast. Let's just do a little check that the gallery works. <laughs> I probably should have that before I went live. I didn't really think about that. Um, okay, okay. Come on, come on, you can do it, you can do it. Oh my God, okay, <laughs> okay, we're good. <laughs> it just might take us a while, but we're good, we should be fine. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> this'll be fun, this'll be very, very, very fun. Um, also, Rums, and Bethany, and Eleanor, and Crossing, and Alex, and Luna, and Dariel, and Stranger, and Denise, and Casserole, and Anna, and Janie, and Maddie, and Grau, and, uh, Nina, and Lady Potato, and Stranger, everybody with the subs and bits and stuff, thank you so much, I really, really appreciate that. Um, you were all very kind. Um, Clay Super Fast, we saw Shell Tours, the Shell Tours are always so fun. Um, Shell Tour Day is always a good one. Um, so these are the tours for our Circle Shell. Um, we started doing these like two weeks ago and then we had some gallery problems so we had to stop and we're going to try and finish the tours today. Um, if you didn't build for the circle shell, uh, please don't enter <laughs> the request to be toured. Uh, the way that you enter, if you click on the little like egg icon at the bottom of chat, um, you'll see a request to tour your build. Make sure you type your origin ID in there so that I can find it. Um, and we're going to just draw them randomly out of those requests, if that makes sense. Um, that is the plan for today. Um, we're just gonna draw them randomly out of the requests, um, just like we normally do. So don't just like type it in chat or anything. I won't. It won't be saved for me to see. <laughs> uh, I'm not like taking requests from chat. Like like don't be like please pick me. Um, we're gonna try and do it randomly. This is the thing. There's gonna be so many people. Like obviously want to give a chance an equal chance to everybody. So. Um, Bear with us. I'm gonna need your origin ID. Yes, yes, not your Twitch ID, your origin ID. I need to be able to find you on the gallery. So whatever your gallery username is, um, make sure you give me that, because uh, that's how I can look up your build. So um, I'm sure you all, you know how it works at this point, <laughs> right? The chicken shell tours? Yeah, that was like two months ago, uh, mister. That was ages ago. We did the video and everything um, a while ago. So we're on to the next one. We are on to the next one. Oh my God. Why, Storm, why? <laughs> well, current, um, current life update. Today, I brought, um, well, I was gonna say a bunch of stuff. Not really a bunch of stuff. My car's not that big. <laughs> but I put some things into my car from my office and moved them to the new house. Um, things like, like, a bunch of my costumes, like, you know, I have that lobster costume and stuff. Um, but I don't exactly need that urgently. I can... <laughs> <laughs> move that to the new place. Um, but I've been moving, I've done that with a bunch of other things, but I haven't done any really like office stuff yet. Um, so we started moving some office things into the room. I now have a series of costumes in my new office um, and not much else. So alas, uh, the weenie suit is no longer in this house. <laughs> Devastating, truly. <laughs> um, but anyway, I should, I, I have so many things. I'm getting so stressed. I'm moving like everything in my office absolutely last, last, last so that I can keep recording and stuff. Um, 
but I'm just getting stressed. <laughs> I'm just getting stressed. <laughs> Is the cardboard cutout in the new house yet? Oh no, you think I can fit Rick in my car? No, I haven't thought about that yet. I need to- that's a problem for another day. Rick's still in this room, he's right there. He doesn't fit in my car. I guess I haven't tried, but, um, I don't think Rick's gonna fit in the car. So, <laughs> Rick's gonna have to walk, yeah, he's gonna have to make it on his own. <laughs> um, Grim and Honey and, and Dimples and Alex and Phil and BB and Hyper and LJ and Dancer and Amanda and Mighty and Al and Jenster and Goth and... Uh, Corey and Moon and Emma and Sarah and Kayla and Christine, thank you for the substance of everybody. Okay, I think we should be good to go. Let's begin with the shells tours, shall we? Um, so again, we're gonna just draw them randomly and then we're gonna look people up. I'm gonna try to get through as many as I can, but there's a lot of people. There's already like 300 requests and I've been live for six minutes. It's just not gonna, it's, you know. <laughs> um... We're, we're not gonna be able to do them all, we'll try our best. Um, and the first one is gonna be Soph underscore Suds, whose Twitter or gallery name, I almost said Twitter name. Their gallery name, not Twitter, <laughs> is Panda's Rule 33. Um, and we'll start it. I didn't make a bingo card for this one, Dory. Um, as I said, I was uh, packing my office closet and driving it to my new house today. Um, so I did not have time to make a bingo card. <laughs> I only got home like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> I spent like all morning just like going through. I mean, I have a lot of stuff that I was trying to go through and organize too. You know, it's one of those things. Um, okay, Panda's Rule 33. Let's do it. Um, <laughs> Sulani Island Cafe. Oh, fun. Okay, lots of stuff in Sulani for this one, for this shell. Um, can you request multiple times? You shouldn't be able to, Eleanor. It should just let you pick it once. Um, Okay, time to go to Solani, and we will place this down on the sandbar as a cafe. Let's do it. Um, yeah, it should only work once. If you try and redeem it again, it shouldn't let you. Um, so, and it, nothing has changed with, I've been using the same point redemption thing for like a year or so. Um, there shouldn't have been any settings changed on that. I really like this. I've never done a cafe in Sulani before. I've built, like, obviously this lot used to be a bar, so I've built a bar on this lot before, but I haven't done a cafe, which is so fun. Look, you walk in, you got, like, this spot where you can buy your coffee. I like the little, like, um, decor. <laughs> oh, God. I'm forgetting words, and this is gonna be a disaster. We got a little bathroom right here. Pride flag on the wall. There's even a computer. This is really cute. I like the blue. Like, the color scheme is so fun. Oh, and you know what? This cafe sign matches so well. How many, like, what swatches does that have? Do you know what? I don't think I've ever used this. We should build a cafe soon. That's really nice. That looks really good. I also love this, like, the vines that they put on top of this. It looks really, really nice there. Yeah, build inspired by that sign. Yeah, seriously. Build inspired by specifically the pink swatch on this sign. <laughs> I really like your build. The lot is filled in so well, too. There's, like, some beach space that you can hang out on. It's right by the water. And this is this is really nice. This is really nice. I like that a lot, so... Um, I'm sorry if it seems like I'm going fast. I just want to make sure we get through as many as possible. <laughs> um, we'll do our best. We'll do our best. Um, okay, the next one that we're gonna do will be Madison Emily 8 on the gallery, and they're- nope, on Twitch, and the gallery is Darla K219. Um, yeah, we did the circle tours, Holly, a couple weeks ago, but we were having some issues with the gallery not working, so, um, we decided we were gonna do it again. <laughs> um, and now we're having some issues with the sky. The sky is, uh, angry, <laughs> so... You heard that one? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, just give it some time. Just give it some time. Simsy Circle. Circle Tree House! Oh, that's fun. They live in a little circle tree house along with their dog and the wild animals. Cute! Okay, does this belong out in, like, Granite Falls? Or is this just in... Wait, what lot size was that? I'm sorry. Oh no. <laughs> Please come back. 
Oh, gallery, please. <laughs> it's Glimmerbrook. That's what I thought. Um, we'll do it in Glimmerbrook. We'll go place 40 by 30. Yeah, I thought it was 30 by 20, so it's a good thing I double-checked. Da, da, da. Oh. Hopefully it lets me place it. Cross your fingers. Really, Sage? Yeah, it's been it's been a, a rough day. It's been storming for a while today, too. And it looks like it's going to keep storming for a while. For the next few hours. So. Alright, here we go. This one, this one is Madison Emily's. And it's a tree house! Oh my gosh. Okay, so we've got a pond out in the front. Of course, the three Ps. I love the landscape. I love the landscaping. <laughs> Um, oh, are there ads playing? Oh, I'll wait. I did not realize. You can stare at the, um, solar panels. So. <laughs> we can admire the graves. It's, they're supposed to, it's, there's 30 seconds left. You know? It's all right. You put in the request, but you want to take it back as you realize you cheated? Lee, don't worry. I mean, chances are we won't pick yours. <laughs> There's so many, but also it doesn't matter if you cheated. I don't really care. It's like not that big of a deal, you know? Um, fine by me. Uh, Jen and Panda, and let me read books. Girl on Fire, Emma, Bruce Magic, Shiny, High Quality, uh, Laurie, and oh no, Allie, Tiggy, Grim. Thank you for the substance, everybody. I really appreciate that. I really, really appreciate that. Um, okay. We have graves over here. Polar, thank you for the resub too, sorry. Um, we got the graves back there. Underneath the house, we've got like some hangout space. We've got like some skill building easel, place to sit, grill, fire pit, bees. Incredible, incredible. Upstairs, we've got a... <laughs> Upstairs, we got a huge porch. Um... <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> this will be interesting today. Um, we have a huge porch. We've got some like vertical planters. I love the vertical planters. And then when you actually come inside, I like the like storage stuff because obviously it's a tree house. The bird pictures too, because it's a tree house. We have a little kitchen over here, which honestly is laid out really well. It's so hard to do the floor plan in these rounded rooms. Like, it's so difficult to figure out where to put everything. Uh, we have a bedroom right here. I like the fireplace and the little shelf above the bed. That's so cute. And then we also have this little bathroom right here. I like these, these like, this sink and stuff is so fun. It's got a, kind, of, kind of got like a more destroyed tile too. Um, and then on the roof, we've got solar panels. I really like this one. This is really, really nice. It's, oh, hi. Do you wanna hang out? Jump, jump. You can make it. Do you want on my lap or on the desk? Okay, on my lap. <laughs> um, let's go on to the next one. I wanna try and get through as many as possible. I'm really gonna try. All right, the next one is door smell. Door smell. Door smell. Their name is the same on the gallery as it is on Twitch. I like it. <laughs> I feel like I've said that before about your username, that I like it. I remember this name. <laughs> I recall this username. You're being cute, Snappy. Oh my god. It takes longer for the gallery to load than it does for us to tour the build. <laughs> okay, we're looking for a circle. Simsy chicken. Oh, here we go. Simsy circle. It's a mushroom. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, it's a 50 by 40 lot. For years, it was a loved national park, uh, but for the last 20 years, we've got a, a man named <laughs> Chanterelle Rick living here. And all the inhabitants of Henford on Bagley now fear this place. Oh. Nice. Nice. Okay, let's go. My cat is sitting across my arms, so I, I don't have access to my left arm at the moment. Um, so you're gonna have to bear with me. <laughs> I only have one one arm that we can use for stream. Luckily, I can move the mouse. <laughs> but 
but I, I can't use the other one. Uh, okay, this one is Door Smells uh, Mushroom Build. Oh, look at that. It's got like a lazy river through it. That's so cute. Are you joking? Did you place all these lights individually? <gasps> that looks so good. Uh, also, this tree, I've never used that debug tree. That looks really good there. We have like a little boat, a dock, the bridges. <laughs> Cat butt in the face. <laughs> There's mushrooms everywhere, kind of like some rundown cars and stuff. And then the actual building, the door is over here in the back. I'm scared of what's, what I'm going to encounter when I enter this building. It's not scary. It actually looks really nice. <laughs> I wasn't sure what to expect. I'm like, the thing's a giant mushroom, you know? You never know what's gonna happen when you walk inside of one of those. <laughs> oh, this is a custom path. They placed all these individually. Okay, sorry. When you walk in, also, I totally forgot about these markings. These are the stage markings. You know what? I totally forgot that we had those swatches from Get Famous, that's really good to know. Okay, so in here we've got like a little dining room, there's like a little fireplace and stuff. We've got a bathroom downstairs like with some older like wooden fixtures. Uh, we've got this sort of rundown bedroom. We have this adorable little kitchen. Look, they've even got like cups and some bread out and stuff, some food on the floor. And then upstairs, they made it two stories, which you're allowed to do. You could, you could have stacked it as many times as you wanted. You could have it be four stories if you wanted. I don't know why you would, but if you did, you could have. <laughs> Um, and when you come in up here, we've got like a little, it looks like hallway upstairs. There's a really, really messy office. Um, suspicious room behind the bookcase door full of dead people and money. Okay. And a living room. <laughs> <laughs> and also we've got this little like art room. This is really fun. I bet you had the best time like building this. The landscaping looks so good. Oh. Yeah, we weren't joking about the dead people. Yeah, they're everywhere around here. It's like, you all know how to make me feel excited when you're doing these builds. You're like, <laughs> everybody just puts graves in their builds. <laughs> We're like, oh, cute mushroom house. Dead people. <laughs> Did you stack yours three high, Sky? Oh my gosh. I'd be curious to see what you managed to do with that. I would have struggled so much with that if I tried to stack it that tall. Okay, I'm going to try and go to the next one because, again, I'm trying to make sure we get through as many as we can. The next one we're going to do is Lemonade Lizzie. And it looks like they don't know what their gallery name is. <laughs> they gave me two options. It's LLYZ... E E or L L Y Z Z I E. So we're not sure which one it is. We'll find out. Just wait for the game to figure it out. <laughs> rocket ship? Oh, yours is a rocket ship? Oh. Oh, that is fun. <laughs> oh, that is. Okay, probably not this one then. So we'll try the other username. Uh oh. Maybe it is this one. Come on. Come on. Can you still hear the thunder? Because, oh my goodness. It's a bit much for me. Much like this seems to be a bit much for the gallery. Here we go. We made it. Big mistake, Simsy Chicken. Um. Oh, I'm not filtering by newest. Simsy Circle. <gasps> Circle Dale High. Wait, so you use the circle as like an amphitheater type of thing? What? <laughs> oh, hang on. <laughs> hang on just one second. What? 
When we do these shell tours, I like actually can't believe it. You're feeling so happy. Oh, Lizzie, I'm so glad. You even have terrain paint? Are you joking me? Wait, I forgot to comment on your build. Hang on, then we'll get to it. I'm sorry. Okay, let's go look at this. So they rebuilt the high school. Obviously that's like unrelated to the shell, but this is what the shell is. They turned the shell <gasps> into a stage for the performing arts class. Oh my God. No, that is so cool. This theater looks so cool from the outside. What a fun idea. We've got like a backstage section. We have the little bathrooms and stuff. How did you come up with this? They've got a basketball court here. And then obviously in the rest of the build, we've got like the main high school. So you come in, it looks like over here, we've got a library. Uh, we got some bathrooms, couple classrooms. We've got the cafeteria. There's a little principal's office. Upstairs, we have some chess tables and some computer labs. Are you, there's like a debate room. Oh, that's so smart. No, this is so fun. I bet this stage was like a nightmare to try and make function. So I'm um, extremely impressed by you. <laughs> uh, I could just, I could just picture like the, cause I've tried to use platforms in a circle before. So I, this, this was brave, Lizzie. <laughs> you are very brave and this is so cool. What a fun idea. It fills the lot in really well too. Cause it's actually like quite a small building but it like fills everything in really nicely. It's pretty good. I'm really impressed, like really impressed. We've seen so many different things already. Like every single one of these shells has been like the complete opposite of each other. <laughs> okay, the next one we're gonna do is Sammy Draw, whose name is Sam underscore Antha underscore Draw on the gallery. Um, let me pull this up. Let's go see what we got to work with here. <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> we made it. <gasps> you made a lighthouse? Oh, you are very brave. Very brave. <laughs> it's unfinished? Oh, don't worry. That's totally fine. That is totally fine. How do people like... When I tried to build a lighthouse, I, I, I didn't furnish it because I, my, my tower was too small. I couldn't get anything in it. <laughs> I tried to make a lighthouse, but, uh, the lighthouse didn't want to be made. I made it too small to put like a ladder or a staircase in. And so I couldn't, it wasn't actually that small. Um, but it apparently was too small according to the game. Look at how tall that is. What a cool idea. Okay, and then on the inside, we've got, like, obviously we have this, like, living space. And then they didn't get a chance to finish the whole thing. But this looks so much better than what I tried to build. Like, I really, I really enjoy the, like, round... You placed all those individually? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to yawn. I don't know why that, I, that was not... I was, I was shocked and in awe of this. That's so good. That's really smart. I, I feel like considering how hard of a time I have with my lighthouse, I like, I have some notes I could be taken from this. <laughs> that looks so good. Also, I'm not joking. I have literally never noticed this waterfall before. I guess I don't usually build on this lot. I usually build on that one instead. But that waterfall is so pretty. I should build in this lot more often because that looks really good. Lesson learned, I guess. This is in Brindleton Bay. I'm so impressed. This staircase you made is really cool too, like going all the way up. I'm, I'm very impressed with this one. That's a fun idea. Also, you made it really tall, which <laughs> I would never have dared to do. I was too scared to make it that tall. Okay, the next one is Chanty30. And their gallery is Chanty037. Chanty037. <laughs> ah, circle shell challenge. Cute, it's a cozy cottage home. Although it seems that they fled here after something terrible happened to them and they haven't been seen since. 
<laughs> oh. Well, that's unfortunate for them, it seems. Um, I'm sure they'll be alright. I'm expecting graves, too. I'm hoping for, like, some hidden dead people. That's my dream. Oh, does your gallery not want to work? Oh, Patricia, don't even say that out loud. I've, I'm scared that it's going to happen to us. <laughs> I'm, I'm really nervous that our gallery is going to stop working, too. Um, if she's been taking so long to load, like, when I try and search the usernames. So I'm a little bit like, uh-oh. Um, is this live? Yeah, it is, Sophia. <laughs> I am live right now. Okay, so we've got this sort of like hidden cottage back here. They've got the terrain sort of raised it up. This looks so natural. Can I just emphasize that? Like, this looks so good. This is probably some of the best terrain work I've ever seen. I could never pull this off. I honestly think that looks great. I'm like really, really happy with how you did this. I, I feel like I have a lot to learn from this. That's really cool. Like genuinely amazing landscaping. Okay. Is that a generator? Oh, fun. And then on the inside, oh, it's fancy. Also, I think I placed a lot backwards. <laughs> this might be the front. Uh, but on the inside, we've got like a little entryway. We've got a little desk. In here, we've got a bathroom in the center. Over this way, we have a huge gourmet kitchen. And they dared to put rounded counters. They, they put them against the wall, like following it. That looks really nice. I, I didn't dare try a rounded kitchen, so you should be proud of yourself for that one. <laughs> um, and then through here, we've got the bedroom. This is so nice. Look at your closet, too. Oh. I feel like I have so much to learn from all of you in your shell builds. Like, I just think this looks so cool. This, like, custom fireplace you made. Like, actually, what on earth? Are you joking? Like, how? How? Is that a half wall? <gasps> oh my god. It's a half wall covered in shelves. Is that like a size down window? There must be a window hiding somewhere in there. I'm really impressed by that. <laughs> that is really cool. I need to get better about doing stuff like that. I never bother with stuff like that, but it always looks so good. Cass says, what the heck? I came into this and now I have to head out. Yeah, <laughs> this is the thing. You tune in and then I swear it like hurts your feelings. I want to look at this one later. I'm going to dig around and try and find that window. That's really cool. Like really, really cool. How do you all pull this off? Like genuinely, how do you pull this off? Okay, I'm going to do private papaya next. I'm sorry to like skip past. I just want to make sure we get through as many as we can. Their gallery name is lalal4169. <laughs> Quaint circle shell. Show me, what do you got? Oh, there's a pond. Jill the spellcast removed the glimmer book, moved in a glimmer book. Ooh, interesting. This is fun. Oh, door smell. <laughs> we were just on their build. That's really weird. What a coincidence, right? Like... <laughs> okay, let's go place this one over here. We've seen a few Glimmer Book ones today. Hi, door smell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Here we have... I'm not sure I put it on the right lot or not, but it's okay. We get it. We've got this pond in the back filled with fish and stuff. So cute. Um, over here, we've got a little garden. Of course, we've got a cauldron. Is it door smell or is it do or smell? Oh, do or smell or door smell. Interesting. I hadn't thought about that. I prefer door smell. <laughs> I 
anyway, on the- <gasps> Ooh, they the loft thing. This always looks so cool. So we have these like giant windows in the corner. And then you walk inside, we have a little kitchen right here. We've got a little living space. And then upstairs, we have this lofted area with a huge bathroom. I think when they do this kind of thing, when people do like the- This is just it's on a platform, it's on a huge platform. It always looks so cool. Like, that's such a fun, um, such a fun idea. I really like that. Okay, chat votes for door smell. All right. <laughs> I, I didn't see if door smell said anything about it, so. <laughs> I guess it isn't up to them, it's up to us, maybe? It's door smell, there they are. They speak. All right, the answer is there. <laughs> Anyway, I like this a lot. I like this plant wall too. That looks so cool. Oh, I want to build a loft now. I'm feeling like kind of inspired to try and build a loft myself, you know? I like that a lot. All right, let's go skip to the next one. We're gonna do Molly OCO next. Molly OCO 29 on the gallery. <laughs> Come on. There we go, we made it. <gasps> Mediterranean rental. Come explore Sulani in this Mediterranean style rental. Cool. It's like over the water. Let's go see this one. We've seen so many different builds today. I didn't actually look at what um, size the lot was, so hopefully it fits on this one. Cause if not, that would be bad. Oh well, I need to be better about looking. Silly me. I think it is right. Oh, maybe not. Something's going on here. Oh, something is really going on here. What the heck? Why is- what happened to the stairs? Let's try again. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> That's very weird. Okay, we try this one more time. Come on. Oh god, game, why? <laughs> Newest. Yeah, see? There's supposed to be stairs there. And there's not supposed to be weird wood things on the floor. So I don't know what the... What the game is doing. Okay, it's- it's placing wrong. It's placing wrong, but just... That's not their fault, because it's fine on the gallery. It's, I think it's the game's fault. I think that, like, the the platform... I don't know. I don't know what's happening, but it's really bizarre. It's not- I don't think it's their fault, though. I think it's just the game being buggy. So pretend there's a staircase right here. <laughs> no, I put move objects on. Don't worry, I put it on. I did that before I played- that's why I placed it again. Could be the lot that I placed it on. Yeah, it could be, but... We'll just pretend the stairs are there and we'll look at it. It's not their fault. Um, blame the game. So we've got this amazing front door. And you walk in and it's all just one room open for the vacation rental. So you come in, we have this luxurious bed by the windows. We've got the kitchen in the middle. With like an under the sea viewing point on the floor. And then we have the bathroom just open to the outside, which is so cool. This is really fun. Like what a fun, fancy idea. Cause uh, the idea obviously is that no one would be here. So nobody would see you, but what a cool spot to take a bath. And then out here we've got like some more seating and stuff and a grill. And then down here we've got like a dock so you can get into the water. Oh, sorry, I can't stop yawning. I like this a lot. Yeah, you can take a bath and then just jump straight into the ocean from there. You can just jump out if you wanted to. That's really cool. Stop making you yawn. I know, Tilly, I'm sorry. I just made everybody yawn. <gasps> She's getting into her cat bed. I moved it over because I was vacuuming and now she's climbing into it. She hasn't sat in it in a while. Maybe she was over the placement. Oh, no, never mind. She left. Okay. <laughs> she walked out of the room. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> um, she stepped in and then stepped straight out. So never mind. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do Frame's Wife next. Frame's Wife 5591 on the gallery. Oops. Let's go see it. Cat cam? I can't do a cat cam. She left. Like, left, left. 
she's out. She's no longer in the room. <laughs> uh, okay. Simsy Circle Shell Flower Hut. Oh, cute. It's a gardener's dream home. Oh, I'm excited to see it. Okay, this is a 30 by 30 in Newcrest. See, I checked the lot size that time. Okay, let's go see. Yeah, that's the thing. I like drew attention to her and then she was like self-conscious so she left. That's what happened. <laughs> okay, here we have the gardener's dream home. Oh my gosh, this is so fun. We've got this like flower garden in the front. Um, I love the like fence around the whole place. You walk in, we've got a little pond back here. Off to the side, we've got some more garden space. Uh, we have this little like patio attached to the house. Sorry, I'm yawning again. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Um, okay. And then you actually come inside of the house. And on the inside, we've got like the main living space here when you first come in. We've got a bathroom here, a kitchen off to this side with a huge island. That's so nice. And then we have this bedroom right here. I love the yellow bed. Oh, that's so cute. That looks so good. I think the landscaping though, like this area, like this little flower garden, I love this. I think that looks so pretty. I love shell tours. You're all so talented. It's so fun seeing what you all come up with. It, I also, like, I feel like I get so inspired. I'm sitting here, I'm like, oh, I want to build, like, a little flower garden. I've never used these to put, like, a flower garden on. That's so cute. <laughs> and then also that patio is right off the kitchen, so you've got the grill and everything right there. I think that's a great way to make the circle, like, less circle-y. To have a roofed patio. Um, what's the name again? Oh, here, wait. Oh, jeez. There you go. There you go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna read some subs really fast. Uh, Jay and Caddy and Nell and Ems and Laura and Anxious and Rebecca and Tilam and Jessica and Parrot, uh, Kester and Keithy and Max and Barton and Kathy and Lexi and Sid and Rap. Thank you all for the subs and stuff. Let me save my game again really fast too, because I'm starting to get paranoid about the sky. Um, yeah, we're randomly choosing the, the tours, by the way, chat, just so you know. Um, we're trying to go through these to the best of our ability and, like, make sure everybody has, like, an equal chance of getting picked. So, um, we're, we're randomly selecting the people that request the point redemption. Um, there's been a whole bunch of them. There's, like, 500 requests. Um, obviously, we can't do all 500 on stream. <laughs> it's physically impossible, so uh, bear with us, okay? Beth and Bewitched and, and Pi and Jay and Caddy, thank you for those resubs too. Does she ever sleep, ever? Steve, it's been a long day already. <laughs> also, Steve, the sky is angry. It is like storming, storming today. I'm, I'm getting nervous. <laughs> I'm starting to get nervous. Um, anyway. All right, let's pick the next one, shall we? Banana 75. Banana 75, that's a nice name. Also, Dandelion and Vibrant, thank you for the subs. All right, let's go. <laughs> Circle Shell Challenge. Oh, this one looks cute. <gasps> Eco Lot is home to a young mom with a teenager. Wait, this looks so cute. Where is that? Is that in Mount Komorebi? That is beautiful. Let's go see. 30 by, was it on a 30 by 20? I think so. I'll place it here and see it. We'll place it here and see it. <laughs> All right, load in, come on. Come on, game. You could do it, I believe. I believe. Come on. There we go. Oh, this looks so good! I put it on the wrong lot, but... <laughs> Either way, it fits and it looks really nice. What a fun idea. I like this leaf on the roof, too, as like an accent. So we've got a little pond over here. And they used the shell twice. Once as like a greenhouse with like a rooftop hangout space. And then once as the main house. Oh, I love this. 
I love this color scheme. This is so pretty. Are you kidding? I just adore the like the light wood and all the fun bright colors. That looks so nice. I also like how they use the shell twice, but like with fences this time. And they used it to make like a a sort of hangout space. I don't know, I just think that's so cool. In the back, we also have a little garden too. And it's already planted. So if you wanted to play here, you totally could. And they got solar panels and everything. I really like this one. I might say that's my library too, just so I can look at it again later. Cause I really like that, the rooftop idea. I need to like study how other people do rooftops because I always feel like I can't pull it off. Like I feel like I can't make it look good whenever I try. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry to be like going through them fast. I just want to try and get through as many as possible. I know I keep saying that, but all right. Artsy Emma is the next one. Artsy Emma. Ba -bum. Artsy Emma. Also, uh, Moonlight and Owl and Unagi and Dandelion and Vibrant and Bewitch. Thank you for the subs. I'm doing amazing, Bestie. Thanks. I'm trying my best. <laughs> I am trying my best. Um, okay. Circle Family Cottage. Oh, cute. Sorry, I shouldn't spoil it. For a three-person household. For their kid, a couple, and a llama. Wait, what lot size was that? <laughs> They've got a llama. All right, let's go put it up in um, Henford on Bagley. Yeah, and a llama. Yeah. No, I didn't make that up. That's what it says. So... <laughs> uh, but like, thank you for the resub too. Thank you so much. All right. So they made theirs like multiple stories. It's two stories, which I could not pull off. I, I was way too scared to even try something like that. So here we have the most important part, the llama. <laughs> um, we've got a little garden here. They've got a clothesline. We have a huge pond. The house is kind of built over the water, which is so beautiful. And then when you first come inside, the entry's, on the, the entry's on the side door over here. And then you walk in, we've got like a little desk, staircase, and a door into the bathroom, which is beautiful. We have this like kitchen and dining space. You can tell they play tested it because there's some used grilled cheese. Um, <laughs> and we've got a, a big bedroom right here. And then upstairs, <gasps> It's lofted! Oh my god, that's so cool. Upstairs we have like a big open lofted space, the living room, and then that kid's bedroom they had talked about. Oh my gosh, I really like that. The kid has an ensuite bathroom too, they're lucky. Wow, I didn't even think about the, like, like lofting it with actually two stories. That looks really cool. With it above the kitchen and everything. I'm impressed. I'm really impressed. That's such a fun idea. I like this glass roof, like this, just this area in general is really pretty as well with the flowers and the pond and the table. I mean, maybe not ideal for the kid. <laughs> um, hopefully they don't fall off. There's no railing, but luckily it's the Sims. And that's not a concern. <laughs> luckily it's the Sims and there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> that's so cool. It's an older kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they can swim. They can swim. It's fine. Emma says so themselves, so. <laughs> uh, we're gonna do the next one. This one is from Jake12893. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. I like how in The Sims, you don't have to worry about like safety, code, physics. You can just put whatever you want wherever you want. <laughs> I think it's way more fun that way. If you want it to be floating, by all means, go for it. Simsy's Circles in Bali. At Simsy, thank you for uploading the apartment shell from yesterday too. <laughs> They're sending us messages from beyond. <laughs> Was it you who asked yesterday? That's really funny, actually. I remember that. Um, <laughs> Earth and film and moonlight. Thank you for the subs. <laughs> This is cool. This is really cool. This is 50 by 50 lot. Um, okay. 
Let's go into Sulani again. Lots of builds in Sulani. People that we usually have a lot in Sulani though, just in general, I found. People like to build in Sulani. But obviously with the circle especially, because of stuff like this, you know. Um It is still thundering so much. Last night I had a meeting at seven. Um and I like as soon as I got in the call, Dan was still live. So some of you might have heard this <laughs> if you were in Dan's stream last night. But as soon as I got in the call, it was like the loudest, longest thunder I have ever heard. It went on for so long and it was so loud. <laughs> and it was like the second I joined the Zoom call. It was wild. You heard that yesterday? Yeah, it was a lot. It, it went on for ages. <laughs> and the thunder was like, the sky was like, all right, Kayla has joined the Zoom call. <laughs> Um, okay, so here are these amazing, amazing, like, resort pieces. So, okay, here are you, what happens? So you walk in. Oh. <laughs> I don't think they finished it yet. <laughs> That's okay. The vibes are still there. We can tell what you were going for. There's some that lots of people have them, like, not finished, so they wanted to upload it just in case. But I like this layout. Like, you come in, there's, like, this main, I guess, like, shared space. We've got a couple of private ones right off the beach, and then you can access three more over here. And they all have a bathroom. They're huge too. Yeah, it is, it's almost kind of fun to see people's like unfurnished versions, because it's kind of fun to see like what their thought process was, like as they were starting it, you know? Like you can kind of see what they were thinking, like maybe they wanted to have the beds laid out in this area because they wanted it to be facing the view and stuff, you know? Like I just think that's so, so cool. I like seeing the, the work in progress type of stuff, you know? Um, I like the color scheme too, it's really pretty. That's super nice. Okay, let's go through as many as we can. The next one is Caden underscore locks. And their gallery is copy paste. Come on. And it's a beach house thing, so they say. <laughs> Your thought, thought process is usually how do I introduce more llamas? Yes, yeah, Steve, that's fair enough. Um, don't we all have that thought process? How and where can I put in more llamas? This is cute. Single sim living in Sulani and it has a plant roof. Oh, don't replace my own build just yet. I need that still. Uh, I, have, I have to. I uploaded it to the gallery. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Um, <laughs> come on. Load Insufficient funds. Oh dear. Okay, now I have to do it again. I have to kick the sim out and do it again. <laughs> oh no. All right, go away. One more time. Oh dear. Oh dear. Is this gonna be a YouTube video? Well, well, this won't be a YouTube video, but I'll film a second, like a, a, a different YouTube video doing this, yeah. But I'm not gonna like cut this stream into a video. I usually film the the shell tour separately for YouTube. Um, but I'll make I'll make one for YouTube as well. But I usually film it again. I film it separately. This is our second time doing the shell tours on stream because we had issues with the gallery and my game crashing last time, so I gave up. <laughs> I got so stressed out I had to stop last time because my game kept crashing. Um, okay, come on in. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up. You can do it, game. You can do it. You're all right. Oh, <gasps> look at the living roof. And they've got a bunch of solar panels too. You know what? Something I've seen a lot of um, in everybody's builds today and also last time we toured these shells was there's a lot of like eco houses, lots of solar panels, um, lots of stuff like that going on in people's builds this time around which is really fun. This looks so cool. All these plants look amazing on the roof like that. Is there a winner with these? No, Olivia, we don't like pick an individual winner or anything. That's impossible. There's thousands of shells. I like literally impossible. Uh, and uh, like they're they're all good in different ways. Like you're not there's no win winner like that. Um we just do it for fun. Okay. So when you actually <laughs> When you actually come in <laughs> We've got uh, this beautiful, like, bluey, tealy kitchen. Little dining table. We've got a little office nook. Huge living room. 
And then up this big lofted staircase into the back, we have this amazing bedroom with a wonderful view of the water. I love this. I love this back door too. Like you come out this way onto this big deck. That just looks so good. I never thought to use this tent thing like that either. It fits in really well on the corner that you did. I like how they kind of rounded it. I don't know. All right, Steve says zero llamas, zero out of 10, would burn it all down. Okay. <laughs> um, so apparently, sorry, Kaden, um, your build has no llamas, so therefore it's worthless. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> this looks really good. This is called the Circle Shell Challenge by, oh God, I closed out of it. Uh, it was like W Locks Y A W L O X Y A on the gallery was their username. Okay, next one, next one. I'm trying to get through as many as possible. The next one is Sums B One Two Three. Sums B One Two Three, and their gallery name is Summer Shepherd O Five. No llamas, useless. <laughs> uh, this is the eyeball circle shell. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's place this one down. That's kind of fun. There's just so many different things that people do with them, you know? It's just so- Oh, I'm putting it in Willow Creek, actually. Everyone goes in, like, so many different directions. It's so cool. Okay. When my game crashed with the last Rosa Tour, any builds yet? Yeah, Debbie, we did like 50 of them or something. I did it for like an hour and a half. Uh, maybe not 50. I don't know how many I got through. I did it for like an hour and a half last time, though. We did loads. Okay, this is the exterior. <laughs> That's so interesting. What a fun idea. People do like lots of really funny things with the roof in these sorts of ones. Um, like they'll put like, what? what was the one that someone did recently? I think they put like a, like they painted a picture on the roof with it. It was fascinating. Anyway, on the inside, this floor plan looks great. So you walk in, we have a big living room over here. I like these art pieces on the wall. We've got a little dining space back here. Lovely, huge kitchen. We have a door into the bathroom, which is very red, very fun. And then we have that main bedroom. It's just so fun to see how everybody else like cuts up the floor plans because like I had mentioned, I really struggled with the floor plan in mine. So it's so fun to see what everybody does because I made mine two bedrooms, one bathroom. There's a lot of one bedroom ones. I haven't seen, I don't think any three bedroom versions that are just one story, but it'd be really hard to because you can only put walls in so many places because these are curved. You can't like have a wall coming out of the curve. Um, wasn't giving me my wall tool. I clicked it like three times. Um, but anyway, this is really cool. This is really cool summer. I really enjoy this one a lot. That's so fun. No llamas though. <laughs> Steve says zero llamas, one out of 10. Llamas do have eyeballs. <laughs> so you got a one out of 10. There you go. <laughs> okay. Okay. The next one, the next one is Batman 2035. Steve got real lucky coming in to like one of the only builds that has llamas. Wait. Oh. Okay, Batman 2035 didn't give me their gallery. It just says, hi. Let me check their chat history. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> um. Yeah, their chat history is, I love your videos and hi. Today they said, hi, hi, Simsy lasers, Simsy lasers, Simsy eyes. Uh, no username. <laughs> Are they perhaps Batman 2034? Batman, are you still here? <laughs> it's okay if not. It was nice to see you anyway. Hello, Batman. I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess that Batman didn't build anything for this one. I'm gonna guess. But if Batman comes up and they speak to us, Batman 2035, and you can tell me what your gallery name is, we'll tour yours after. <laughs> okay, the next one is Daddy Leah. And their gallery is Ha Daddy. Is that true? Wow, it is. Okay. Huh. 
Hut Airbnb for rent. Cute. The perfect Airbnb for a small family getaway. That's so fun. Okay, let's go place it in Sulani. They just said hi again. Did they? <laughs> did they just say hi again? Wait, let me check their chat history. Batman, did you build anything for this? Do you have a gallery username? Yeah, they said hi twice more. Okay, I don't think Batman built for this one. Um, I don't think they built for this one. <laughs> but this is this build. This looks so cute. Oh, and this is a totally different floor plan than I've seen. So you walk in, there's like a little entryway space. To the right, we have the kitchen and dining space and also a door into the kid's bedroom. And then to the left, we've got the living room, a door into the main bedroom, and also the door into the bathroom. That's so fun. I love how you split this up with so many walls. Because a lot, like, I, I obviously did mine just kind of, like, in the corners. It's kind of just where I put my walls. So yours is, like, way more interesting, the, the floor plan, than what I did. So I think that looks really good. The kitchen especially, I like how it's split up like this. Zero llamas, three out of ten. Thought Airbnb would have had llamas. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Steve. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually shocked. I mean, I have never stayed in an Airbnb without llamas. So I just can't imagine why there wouldn't be one in this one. <laughs> Leah, that was really good. I like that one a lot. That was so fun. Um, yeah, that's the thing. Wait, I feel like this shell is like deceptively big. Small? You think it's small, but it's actually big. Like, I feel like it looks kind of small, but then you can fit a lot into it. It's it's all right. Um, okay, the next one is Call Me Mother Load. Same on the gallery. Let's take a look. The next shell needs to be llama shaped. Do you know, I've got a rat shell on my stream schedule for next week. You can't make this up. I'm dead serious. So... <laughs> Wait. It's a functional taco shop? And it was the land grabs. They bulldozed the old salt house and they placed this chain restaurant. <laughs> That's so cool. That is so cool. Let's go place it. Oh my goodness. Nacho average shell. <laughs> okay. That is such a fun idea. People, everybody is so clever. You're all so good at this. It's so fun. Look for Rufus. I will, I will. Yeah, like Kim Possible. Yeah, this is so fun. Okay. How did you... Look at that, look, the roof. They have like the straw and then they have like a slightly taller metal one. Taller straw one, taller metal one, to try and make it look like a hat. That was all roof pieces. And we got bike lanes that go around the side. Did you make that? They used the chalk circles and then these like foot illumination systems. Are you kidding? And they made this like fake taco out of a roof piece and a bunch of plants. These are sized up apples. Are you joking? Their gallery ID is call me mother load. They did it again up here on the diagonal. In the back, we have some like outdoor seating and stuff. There's even a bar. And then when you actually come inside, oh my God, look, these are like custom paintings. Um, Obviously, to look like custom menus. So there's some seating inside. We got some bathrooms back here, and then of course the kitchen. This is so cool. Like the drive-through, I just I can't get over this. The way they made it with bikes as well, like. Just because we gotta have cars on the Sims 4, so here's a bike drive through. Like, I don't know, I just I just think that's so cool. Let's look at the menu. Oh, convivial, chef's kitchen, sunny aspect. 
We have some custom outfits and they made a custom menu too. Yeah, look! Oh, that's so fun. I bet you had so much fun building this. That is like legitimately so cool. It's by, okay, so it's by Call Me Mother Load on the gallery. Um, let me filter again by, oh God, I messed up. I wanna try and pull it up again. It's by Call Me Mother Load on the gallery um, and it's called Nacho Bueno, so. <laughs> yeah, life real life's supposed to be. It's so cool, it's so cool. This is such a fun idea. Um, yeah, definitely down that one chat. That, that's fun for your gameplay. I can't get over the sign. And like the bike rack that they have as well. I don't know, I just think that's so clever. And their username's good too. They've got it all. They literally have it all. <laughs> Is that a moat new? No, Sunflower, that one's been there since like, I, my. that's one of my first ever emotes. Did I find Rufus? No, I didn't. I'll leave that for you all, chat. Okay, Danielle, Lil Bird, Victor, Soft, and Liz, and Emerald, and Naya, thank you for the subs. All right, let's go to one more. Let's see. Abland. Abland1234 is the next one. Abland1234. <laughs> oh, they're good. They are good, too. This is the Tropical Circle Getaway. How do you people do this? Like... <laughs> How do you people come up with these things? All right. All right. Let's take a look, shall we? Oh my god, look at the terrain they did! That's so fun! Oh, this one looks really good. I love this like huge platform off the side because it makes it like the, because obviously the shell is only one story. So it helps to like have some differentiation with the heights of things. In the back, we have a little pool and everything. This is gorgeous. I think that this build style is like one of my favorites to do myself too. I just love all the Jungle Adventure stuff so much. It's so pretty. Um, so when you first walk up over here, we've got like this little, um, gazebo sort of thing on the water. And when you come into the house, I love the color scheme with the blue and the orange. We have this amazing tiled little kitchen area. We have a little living room right here. Look at the tigers! That's so fun! And then we have a bathroom down here. And then up in the loft, we have this amazing bedroom. Look at the custom headboard they did! Do you know what? That's really smart for the curved walls as well, because these obviously snap to the wall. So when you put two of them, the headboard kind of curves, like curves a little with the wall. So it makes the bed look like it fits in better. That's really smart. I like that a lot. I haven't thought about you. That's from Eco Lifestyle, right? Oh, Dream Home Decorator. Duh. I hadn't thought to use this. I don't think I've ever used this, to be honest. I don't usually go for like the the big wall pieces. That's really clever. Like really, really clever. I'm impressed. Sophia Fire, thank you for the gifted subs. Thank you so much. Um, <laughs> lots of foliage. Llama would have enjoyed. Still zero llamas. <sighs> Steve, our hearts are just gonna keep getting broken. We're gonna go through all of this and there'll be no llamas. I guarantee it, the next build, zero llamas. No respect for the llama in this household. <laughs> Penny, thanks for the two month reset too. I'm gonna save my game really fast and drink some water. No respect for the llama in this community. <laughs> um, no, Kayla, I usually tour new ones in the video. I mean, so for example, uh, I always do a YouTube video doing shell tours and a stream. In this case, two streams doing shell tours is our second one today. Um, and so sometimes, sometimes there's a little bit of overlap. Like for example, I'm almost certainly gonna tour that restaurant on the on in my YouTube video. Like I, I'll tell you right now, I'm I'm like definitely gonna show this one on my YouTube video. Obviously, we found it on stream today, but like I I, I tend to try and maybe do a couple from stream and then others that are separate. That, that's kind of like the the method. I don't know. It's hard to say, <laughs> but. It just depends, but we usually the, the YouTube video has different builds, unless there's like some 
ones that I think are worth them. It's hard to pick because there's so many that we tour on stream that are so good and I it's a it's a hard balance. I hope you understand. Um, but I do my best. I do my best. Okay. The next one is Hattie Binny is the next one. Let me pull that up. Um, yeah, there's so many bills. That's the other thing. Like we, we just can't get to them all. <laughs> um, Ariel and Danny and Kat and Pink Lady and Albie. Thank you for the subs, by the way. Oh, here we go. You can do it, gallery. There we go. You did it. <gasps> the Finer Diner. Oh my gosh. Simsy could have done a Stanley Humphrey photo shoot here. <laughs> That's so fun. I like this like sort of drive-in vibe to it. This one is for the new high school pack world. Oh, and Hattie's in the chat. Oh, good. I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, I don't always see the people that like, I, I, I assume most of them are still here, but I don't always get a chance to see the people like typing when I like pick on their name. Um, and so it's fun to make when I definitely see them in chat, you know, because sometimes it scrolls past and um, but Hattie is in fact here. Okay, here's this diner. I love the idea of this. This is kind of what I thought I would do. Um, like, like do a restaurant and like extend the roof out to have like some covered seating. It looks like Sonic. <laughs> it looks a little bit like a Sonic. I love the sign too. This is so good. Just in general, we should, we should like build more diner type stuff. Cause this is base game, believe it or not. This like outdoor diner sign. Anyway, on the inside, we've got some more seating, little restaurant stand, and we have the kitchen bathroom. This is just so nice. We've got like the diner menu. It's just so good to have like more restaurants. And this fits in so well with like the vibes of the high school world too, with like the more art deco sort of look to it. Did you use a lot of packs for this? Let me scroll back and look. Oh dear, come on. Oh yeah. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I was like, this is really good. But it, you're welcome to use as many packs as you want. Oh, wait a minute. I never seen this debug thing in my life. You just have exposed me to something beautiful. That is an amazing debug planter thing. And that looks so good with these plants. I've never seen that. Is that a, is it like, is that the right size? What size is that normally? Is that base game? What sort of debug is that? I need to know, this is urgent. Is that from the high school years debug? Normal, that's the normal size? Oh wow, that looks really good. And I wonder if it's new and that's why I haven't seen it yet. But I'm, it's from the high school year debug, okay. All right, everybody write that one down. <laughs> write that down, everybody. We're going to use that soon. Uh, that's so good. I love this build. I love restaurants. I think it's so fun to build restaurants too. This looks just so good. I also like this little like sign base that you made. I, all in all, I just think it's so pretty. You should be really, really proud of yourself for this one. It looks really, really good. All right, let's go. Um, Drew and Swift and Ariel, thank you for the subs, by the way. Okay. The next one is going to be Beakers and Baking, and their username on the gallery is Alligator9393. Let's take a look. Eco Living House, yes. Okay, we got some more eco lifestyle stuff going on. An eco friendly roundhouse for a single sim or a couple. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, it's fun to people's gallery names too. There's always a lot of fun usernames that people have. It's always kind of fun getting to like hear from people. Um, Alyssa, thank you for asking. My day's been nice today. I um, I forgot where I was gonna build this. <laughs> I'll place it here. I don't think that's right, but it's okay. <laughs> My day's been nice today. Um, I did some recording this morning and then I did a bunch of packing and I drove a bunch of stuff over to the new house. I brought a bunch of like my office things that I'm not like actively using. This is gonna sound weird to describe this as an office thing, but I, I packed up all my costumes and I brought them to the new house. Um, <laughs> so um, I did a lot of packing today, so <laughs> really fun stuff. Um, but yeah, I realized me being like, my office supplies, like my lobster costume, <laughs> sounds a bit ridiculous, but... <laughs> anyway, this looks really good. I love this rooftop garden you've got going on with the bees and stuff, that's so pretty. 
In the back? Oh, look at the back with the lights and the kitchen. Oh, that's beautiful. And then on the inside, stop. This looks so good. We have the kitchen in the middle right here, kind of. I like these angled cabinets that you added. And then over here, we've got the living space. We have a little like reading nook. And then up the stairs, we have this like lofted bedroom. I love seeing what you've all done with this. I love the rooftop gardens. I love the lofted rooms. I want to build a loft. Can we, I'm going to put loft on my schedule. <laughs> I want to do a loft now. Loft build. Let's make one. Let's try it. We can do it too. It'll be fun. <laughs> I I just love this. I think it looks so good. I like the like smaller cabinets as well because the wall is a bit like shorter because obviously the railing starts. I like the skinny cabinets. It's really smart. I don't know. I'm just impressed. I'm really impressed. This backyard too looks so good with like the divider wall with the plants. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm getting jealous. Let's go on to the next one. I'm trying to get through as many as we can. I'm really trying. The next one is Phoenix underscore likes underscore bread. I relate. Phoenix Huff Puff is their gallery name. Zero solar powered llamas. <laughs> Steve is really, really holding out hope for some more llamas. I'm, I'm counting on it too, Steve. Me and you both. Newcrest Art Center. Oh, that's, oh, sorry. It can't be all lowercase. I feel like when I type all lowercase cute, I feel like it looks kind of like passive aggressive, but all caps, it's like cute. And so they're like, cute. Like I can't put it lowercase. It's bad. It can't be all lowercase. <laughs> um, so we've got Leslie and, Leslie and her roommate, Marina, opened the Newcrest Art Center together. <laughs> Okay, let's place it over here. I like it. I like it. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's the thing. I don't know if anybody would like actually interpret it that way, but I'm just worried. So I want it to be all caps. <laughs> okay, here's the new Crest Art Center. I like how they use the two different colors on both stories. It's fun because we've seen a lot of like modern builds that are two stories, a lot of like tree house stuff that's two stories. This one's very traditional and somehow kind of works even though it's all a circle um in the oh in the back we have this glass roof with some outdoor space there's like a mural place to sell some art oh that's really nice um and then on the inside you come in we've got a little bar right here we have like a place to practice some woodworking there's a little seating area a pride flag we got a little desk underneath the stairs and then upstairs we got a little kids section. Oh, that's so cute. We have a little kids space and then we have like an easel and a music room. I love the art center stuff. We need to try and build more things like this too. Cause I haven't, the art center is the lot type. It's one of the lot types that came with city living and I haven't built anything like that in ages. They're so fun. They're just so useful for gameplay too. Cause you can put like so many skill building items you know, like you can, you can fit in like so many things that you wouldn't be able to keep at your house because there's not enough space. It's just, it's really good to have a chance to come out to us a, a lot like this. So, all right, let's go to the next one. I'm trying to get through as many as I can. The next one is Lily Rose 10. Zero llamas, but built by Phoenix. So eight out of 10 <laughs> has pride flag. So score revised to 11 out of 10, Steve. Steve's finally impressed. Still in llamas though. All right, Lily Rose 10's gallery is the same as their Twitch. Let's go see it. Come on, you can do it. Come on, come on. Duncan's Deluxe Dealership. Here at Duncan's, we sell luxury cars. We promise to pay our employees fair wages for all the work they do and make sure they are taken care of if they have a complaint. <laughs> After you buy a car, you can park it in your driveway or garage and never use it. <laughs> um, this is a 40 by 30 lot. <laughs> it's like Carvana, isn't it? Yeah, 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 that's so fun. Oh, wait, wrong spot. 
Magnolia Promenade. Let's go place it over here. <laughs> Clearly, Alexis, Graham, Leah, thank you for the subs, by the way. Um, <laughs> I like this idea. I'm very excited about this one. <laughs> oh my god. It's literally like, so have, you might not have seen any of these things in real life. Because how would you? But there's one, there's a thing like this that I've driven past before. Um, kind of near where I live. Literally, like, it, um, to, to give you some context. <laughs> like, <laughs> it's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> Which is just so funny. It's just so funny. And the whole like, it's The Sims 4, there are no cars. I just love this. Okay, so you actually come in. Um, and there's like some cars in the showroom. We've got some desks, obviously, for the salespeople. There's bags of money on the counter. <laughs> oh my god. There's bags of money on the counter. Um, over here, we've got some more office space for the worker. <laughs> They've got like a little break room. We've got some bathrooms. It's like creepily empty with the white walls and stuff too. This feels so real to me. And then we have the car vending machine with the just stacks and stacks of luxury cars. <laughs> oh, I love this build. This is so funny. Like what, a, this is the thing, right? When we do these shell challenges, I give you a circle and Somebody's like, oh, I'm gonna make like this beautiful vacation rental house on the beach. And somebody else is like, I'm gonna make a taco restaurant. And then somebody else is like, I'm gonna make a car vending machine. <laughs> like, it's just, it's just so fun how everyone is so creative and takes it in such different directions. Like, I just think it's so cool. I just, I, I love, I love that about shell challenges. I love that about shell challenges. How do you, how do you come up with this? I also never understood. I, like, I realized they can, like, drive them in. And they've got, like, a, like, a big door and stuff for it. But it's still so bizarre when you, like, go into a room like this and there's cars. It's like when there's a car in the mall. Like, how is there a car in the mall? I get it. There's, like, a big door they can drive it through. But, like, there's a car in the mall. Like, how? how? It's really weird. <laughs> it's, like, the whole thing is so weird. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go to the next one. Um, Annabeth, I'm so sorry, friend. I'm glad that we can hang out tonight. Um, and Grim, thank you for that sub gift too, by the way. Um, the mall cars always freaked you out. Yeah, it's weird. Or like in the airport. Yeah, why are there cars there? I don't get it. Anyway, music in June. <laughs> oh, who says, tour the person five places above me if they haven't been yet. One, two, three, four, five. Emerald Dawn underscore NS. Okay. <laughs> Emerald Dawn underscore NS. <laughs> That's actually really funny. Okay. Um, let's take a look. <laughs> That's pretty nice of you. I like that idea. They're here. They said me? <laughs> you. All right. Oh, they've got an also berry build too. <gasps> Coffee and cakes cafe? I built this cute little cafe in downtown Copperdale. It looks like a little tea party. Oh my God. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, this is really pretty. Let's go take a look at it. Oh, that's so fun. I really like this idea, by the way. I, I like that a lot. All right, let's go in. What do you got for me? Oh, the pink tile on the roof, too. Look at all the windows, and I love the plants in, in between. I feel like I'm at Disney World. Like, it's so, it's so cute and pristine. I love this build. I love the, like, layering of these things. I, this is just so adorable. I think that it didn't put the stuff on the roof like it was meant to. Because the roof in the picture had stuff on it. Okay, come on game. You can do it. You can do it. Come on. Uh-oh, I'm lost. Come on. 
Oh no. <laughs> oh, the gallery is very difficult to operate. Just give it a second. We'll get there. We can look at all their cute sims. Yeah, we've seen a lot of community lots with this one. It's kind of fun because I feel like oftentimes the majority are houses and we see a fair amount of community lots, but it's not all of them. But we've seen a lot of community lots today. It's nice. Okay, it's not placing the stuff. There's supposed to be cute stuff up there and it's not placing. But on the inside, I love how they've got like this centered spot for the menu and like the cafe stuff. There's tables all around. And they made like a rounded bathroom, which I never would have thought to do, but actually looks so cool. Like, what a fun layout for the shape of this. It just like, I feel like this fits together so well. I really like this, like a lot. I'm I'm really impressed with that one. I wish we could see the like rooftop better and which was placing, cause that looks so good. I wanna come visit it. <laughs> I love cafes and the Sims, they're so cute. All right, let's go to the next one, see if we can get through. Oh, I didn't mean to open the gallery. Let's go see if we can get through some more. Vladdy underscore baddy. Whose gallery name is Vspawn7. We spawn seven, sorry. <laughs> Flatty Batty, let's take a look. <laughs> oh, lovely. Iconic, in fact. <laughs> oh, they're a good builder. Hmm. Okay, anybody see any circles? Anybody see any circles? There we go, modern circle house. Wait, that looks cool. 30 by 20 in new crest, it looks like. I'll come this way. The usernames are like half the fun, I swear, these shell tours. <laughs> it's always so fun seeing people's names. I, I've never seen Flatty Batty before, and that's their Twitch name. They've been in chat before, I presume. Um. <laughs> So here's this more modern looking build. What a fun idea for the shape of this shell. I think that looks so good. Come around the side, this landscaping is cool. We've got this little fire pit. We're burning a gnome. So that's cool. Um, <laughs> we got the fun rounded roof. And then on the inside, I like how they use these dividers. That's pretty fun. Uh, we have this little living space, little dining room. Adorable kitchen. I love the open shelves. Uh, and then we have this big bathroom. Oh! The gnome lives here. And he's very stinky. I mean, that is a lot of dirt coming off of you, gnome. A lot coming off of you. <laughs> I like this, this sink section. Oh, we've got a little gnome on the sink. I feel like there's probably a lot of gnomes hidden around here. Yeah, there's probably a lot of gnomes hidden in this house. <laughs> I love the color scheme though. I think this looks beautiful. I like how they've got the flooring um, like angled out like that as well. That just looks so cool. I don't know. I like this a lot. I think that looks so good. Okay. Thank you for the gnomes. That was much, much enjoyed. <laughs> much enjoyed. All right. The next one is Undercover 397. Uh, and their gallery is Rock Paper Sims. What do we got? Was there a gnome in the fireplace and in the trash? Was there? I'm not surprised. <laughs> I'm not surprised by that. Um, this is the Circle Shell by Rock Paper Sims. I like that username too. And it's their first ever shell challenge to try to make a 70s inspired house. Let's go take a look at it. Let's go see. What's my schedule? Well, Heidi, I'm usually live at this time every day, but I don't stream on Sundays. Um, and I stream in the morning on Wednesdays. <laughs> but I'm usually live like now, basically. Most days you'll catch me here at this time. So four o'clock Eastern time I usually stream at. Um, I like how they managed to make it look like a normal house. <laughs> it's fun because it's a circle, but they were like, I'm gonna do a good normal roof. We're gonna have a lovely porch and it looks good. It does look good. Um, okay, 
Anyway, over here in the back, we've got like a little table. We've got chickens, but no llamas. Still good. Still very good. We got a swing set. I love the landscaping. I think that's beautiful. Um, and then you come into the- oh, into the inside. Oh, I really like this kitchen being kind of in the middle with the half wall. That looks so good. Do you know what else? I've never used this wallpaper like as a main wallpaper in a house, but that looks really cute like with the pink or the, the like yellow and the light pink flowers. I really like that. That's so nice. And then we have this main bedroom right here. Smaller kids room. Sorry, I keep yawning. Oh no. I just made all of you yawn just then. I'm sorry. <laughs> and then we have a little bathroom, which I really like the black tile. The black with like the black trim on this one looks really cool. This is a really nice color scheme. And the floor plan looks really good. It's fun also because I feel like a lot of us, myself included, I like cut the floor plan like this way and then had bedrooms in the back. I like how they have like the bedroom on the side and the house to the other side instead of like top and bottom. I don't know, it's just, it's different and it looks cool. Um, I like this house a lot, that's really pretty. Very, very beautiful. Okay, the next one we're gonna do is going to be, let us play 479. <laughs> Steve is now giving up and rolling into the sea because we've still had no llamas. All right, their gallery name, uh, their name is Nadia, so let's pull this up then. If you read the word yawn, you yawn. I know, I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, it's bad, it's real bad. Okay, circle, circle. Anybody see, oh, I'm not filtered by newest. Anybody see a circle? Oh, your builds are cute. <gasps> it's a castle. The renovated stone castle. Yes, this was a nightmare to build. <laughs> oh, I definitely understand where you're coming from with that one, my friend. I need to kick out a family so I can replace their lot in Brindleton Bay. Oh my God, they built a castle. This is my worst nightmare. I can't believe they pulled it off. I would never, I actually would never. Like, this is not for me. It's not for me. <laughs> you won't catch a castle here on this channel. <laughs> uh, let's go place this. I'm so curious to see it. I'm glad we're getting a chance to see this one. That's so fun. Um, also Jay and Parsley and Theo and Kyra and Tofu, thank you for the subs, by the way. <laughs> Hey, bro, thank you for the 28 months, too. I can't believe you pulled this off. Oh, look at that. It's got a moat. The landscaping looks incredible. You did a great job with this. I'm so, so impressed with the landscaping. I like this, like, curvy path up to the front, too, but, like, this landscaping looks so good. How? How? Okay, so on the inside of the house castle. Sorry. Not a house. A castle. Oh, are there ads playing? Oh my god. No, don't worry. I won't. No one's missing anything. Not here on this day. We'll wait. <laughs> we'll wait. Don't worry. Um, let me just clear my notifications. Drink some water. Save my game. Boo. Bad timing. Very bad timing. Um, did you build a castle too? No, don't be embarrassed. Literally any attempt at a castle is iconic. If you attempted a castle, you are so good. You should be so proud of yourself. Like, so, so, so proud of yourself. <laughs> anyway, how's your day been, chat? <laughs> We've we still got like 20 seconds, so... <laughs> what have y'all been up to? Good, you've been having a good day? That's good. I'm glad. I just saw lightning again. I thought it had calmed down. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, I thought it was better, but it seems it is not. Um, okay, anyway. <laughs> what was their idea again? Oh, their idea is, uh, I don't wanna mispronounce it, so I'm gonna show it to you. Um, Nadia, B-O-U-K-1-2-3. 
I'm so sorry. I have a, a deep fear of mispronouncing your names and offending you, so... <laughs> Um, yeah, onto the lightning, I know. Okay, well, the ads should be done. Don't worry, I didn't tour without you all, chat. I didn't realize they were happening just then. That's so annoying. Um, let's go on to the inside, shall we? Shall we? So when you enter the castle, it's been renovated, so it's, like, updated inside. We've got a little entryway right here. I love this with, with the spandrels. Off to the side, we've got, like, a kitchen dining area. Um, in here we've got a little bed- a little bedroom for a kid. A little tiny bathroom in between and also a main bedroom. I love this floor plan. I love this floor plan so much. This, I feel like, turned out so nicely. I'm having so much fun with these shell tours today. <laughs> I just- I can't get over the landscaping. I honestly- I can't get over this, like, pond. And the wall. It just- this looks so good. There's a shower lily. Yeah, it's, um, one of the, like, small ones. Because the room's small. Am I muted? No, I have- I can hear myself. I can see my audio going. My mixer's been broken, so hopefully it's not that. I don't think- no one else has said it, so I think it might be on your end. But you can't hear me say that, can you? <laughs> you can't hear me tell you that I'm not muted because I'm muted on your end. Okay, uh, the next one is gonna be Maya Cat 13 Their gallery name is the same as their origin ID. Let's go take a look, shall we? Uh-oh, apparently Enda Cat's bill has a llama. Not a drill. Interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. Okay, we have the whimsical venue. Oh, is it a wedding venue? 50 by 40. Oh my goodness. Let's go take a look. Um, mm, 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 mm. Where am I going? I think it's in Mount Kamara because it's mountains. Or is it Tartosa? No. 50 by 40? Oh, maybe it's not over here. Maybe it is in Tartosa. 50 by 40? Where is it? <laughs> oh, here. Let's try this one. If it doesn't work, it's, if it's the wrong lot, it's fine. Who cares, you know? Wrong is good. <laughs> it's from Newcrest? It's from Newcrest and there's mountains in the back? Okay, well, now there's water in the back. <laughs> I love the idea of making it into a wedding venue though, like with the pond, imagine it at nighttime with the lights. Look at that. That is so pretty. Oh, this tree over here, too. And then you go onto the inside. Look, look, look! We've got the wedding arch with the tables and everything. That's so beautiful. I love, I love this. But these lights over here and the butterflies, too. You weren't kidding when you called it whimsical. That's really pretty. I bet we could, you could get a lot of good screenshots here, too, for the weddings. Steve says, wedding venue. Zero llamas we can marry. What's the point? <laughs> If there's no llamas, I mean, at this point, why even bother? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, I'm trying to go through, like, I want to make sure we, like, do as many as we can. So I'm sorry it seems like I'm trying to go fast. I'm not, I'm not trying to, like, skip past anybody's individually. I'm just trying to make sure we get through as many as we can. The next one is Ohio X Katie. I'm, I'm Florida Kayla. Not that I want to be, but I am. <laughs> okay. Oh, cute. Oh, cute. Oh, wrong button. Cute. <laughs> it's a little witch hut they built. Oh, fun. This one's from Windenburg. Florida man? No. Florida Kayla. That's bad. No one wants that. That's not a good thing. <laughs> um. Yeah. You know what? If it's if it's the wrong direction, it's fine. I don't need to evict anybody. Hi, Florida Kayla. I'm England Beth. <laughs> I like that. Dan, Florida Dan is better because it's like Florida man, but it's Florida Dan. That's a good one. Okay, here is the front of this house. 
I like the tower on top. That looks so cool. And then inside, oh, wait a minute. This layout's so good. I forgot to do the backyard, so look at that at the end. Um, <laughs> everybody's gonna put their, <laughs> their state and name. I like this meme. <laughs> Very good. Oh, Tennessee Terra is a good one. I like that. Okay, anyway, Florida Dan's still better. <laughs> so we have a little living room right here. We've got a beautiful organ. We've got this little kitchen space with a dining table. Upstairs, we have like all the witch stuff. We got the cauldron, we have a bar and a chess table. We also have a bathroom and a bedroom, which is so nice. I like all the red that they use too. It's hard to use, at least maybe I find it hard to use red because can I tell you, well, I was gonna say, can I tell you a secret? Half of you already know this because I've talked about it before. I used to be scared of the color red when I was a kid because when I was a kid, I was very like superstitious and anxious. Still am anxious, but um, when I was a kid, I was like, red's like blood. Red bad. <laughs> so it was, I was like actually scared of the color red when I was a child. I like, di I didn't want to have like a red folder. Like I was like really, I didn't like red. It was bad. I was scared of it. It creeped me out. So. Um, anyway, I don't use red a lot in my build because I used to be scared of it. I'm not scared of it anymore because I'm strong and brave now. But when I was a, oh, I first looked at the backyard. But when I was a kid, I was scared of it. Strong and brave, she says. <laughs> Chat's like, haha, okay. <laughs> Do you know why you're scared of the color red? Because llamas don't come in red. You know, Steve, actually, in The Sims, llamas come in all colors of the rainbow, even rainbow. Anyway, the backyard is very cute too. I meant to look at this and I got distracted because I always do it first and I forgot to this time. Um, we have this amazing little fenced in backyard with some landscaping, a fountain, a table, some little planter boxes. I love the backyard. I love this kind of landscaping with a little like curvy path and stuff. I think that's so pretty. That is so, so, so nice. All right, the next one is, oh my gosh. <laughs> The next one is end the cat. Wait, 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 wait. The person who said theirs has llamas in it. I'm not joking. Their name is Simlish Graffiti on the gallery. You can't make this up. <laughs> you can't make this up. They built Hagrid's hut, they say. Um, but I... <laughs> it was fate. Perhaps we can all be happy now. What if they lie to their snow llamas? One time somebody lied to me about something like that. I forget what I was asking for, but I was like, I want something creepy. And they were like, mine's creepy. And then it wasn't even creepy. Oh my God, there's llamas. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This is a 30 by 20 lot in Henford on Bagley. There is a llama, I swear. I believe you. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Quantum, uh, Simone, Alice, Emmy, thank you for the subs, by the way, everybody. <laughs> oh my goodness, oh my goodness. You know what, this looks really accurate, too. Like, impressively accurate, and there are indeed llamas. <sighs> I'm so excited. I bet this was so fun to build. Like, look at that. Oh, that's so cool. That is so cool. What a fun idea for the circle. I, I, I wonder if anybody else did that because I feel like that's, oops, I wanted to show you their gallery name again. Their name is Simlish Graffiti on the gallery. It was painful to build. I bet it's really hard to recreate like I was gonna say real things, but obviously like things from films and stuff, it's really hard to make them in the game because the scale's off and it, you know, it's it's really tough. So that's impressive. This is the build, Hagrid's Hut by Sinless Graffiti. Um, that's so cool. That is so, so, so cool. Um, you built Papa Smurf's cabin? <laughs> really? Looks like the queue for the ride in Universal. Do you know what? I've never been on the ride in Universal. The, um, 
the Hagrid's motorbike adventure or whatever. I haven't been to Universal. Well, actually, I went to Universal once since it opened, but it was like soon after the ride opened and the line was like four hours long. And I'm sorry, I'm not... <laughs> I'm not waiting four hours in line for a ride. I'm just not, so... <laughs> One of these days we'll make it back there, but um, I haven't been in a long time, obviously, so... You waited almost before and it was worth it, really? One of these days. One of these days. Maybe I'll try and like rope, dro rope drop it when I go again someday. Like go there as soon as the park opens and get straight in the line. Um, okay. Random Maddie is the next one. Papa Maddie Rocks 2 is their username. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Rope dropping is scary. Yeah, I haven't done that before. I've never gone to a park at open. Um, but <gasps> the fishbowl. That's what Miv did though when Miv came to Florida and they had great success. Um, so. Okay, this is a fishbowl restaurant. They said, I had no clue how to landscape this because my favorite bushes didn't go around the curves nicely. <laughs> No, I relate to that so much. You have no idea. It's like, but if I can't use this bush, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> no, I, I so much relate to that. You have no idea. I We are all in this together. We are all the same. <laughs> it's like when I was trying to do a build, I did a video where I tried to build with no cheats. I'm telling you, when I tried to landscape a house without move objects, Like, I, I don't know how to function like that. I, it's, it's like, impossible. Like, I don't know. Anyway, there's a giant fishbowl. <laughs> they weren't kidding, it's a giant fishbowl. Um, and then on the inside, it's a, it's a restaurant. I presume it's a fish restaurant. Yeah, it's, it's got like all seafood and stuff. And ice cream! And then when you come inside, we've got like some dining tables downstairs. We've got a little kitchen, a couple of bathrooms. Upstairs, we've got some more seating. And then a giant fishbowl! <laughs> I think that's so fun. What's scary about rope dropping? Well, okay, so from my understanding, um, this builds a really cool idea, by the way. And your landscaping does look good. Rope dropping, um, that's when you go to a theme park, like, when it first opens. I think the word stems from, like, back in the day at Disney. They used to, like, like, literally carry a rope to, like, walk people into the park and then, like, drop it and they would run in when it opened. Um, I think that's, like, the, the origin of the word, but it just means, like, going to the park as soon as, as, soon as it opens. Um, and it, I guess, to an extent, it's kind of scary because there's a lot of crowds. They still carry a rope? Oh, really? I, I wouldn't know. <laughs> I wouldn't know. But there's a lot of crowds early in the morning, obviously. And there's also some people do it. Like, when you think about, like, the big rides at Disney, um, like, the Star Wars ones and stuff, like, the people, um, they, like, run. Because they want to get in line first so that they don't have to wait. Um, so, it gets to be a bit much, I think. But again, I have not been, so. They get yelled at for running? I'm sure they do. You aren't supposed to run in the theme parks, but... I don't know. Um, okay, the next one is Yumi underscore J, the Three Little Pigs house. Oh, that sounds like fun. Your mom once got yelled at for running in Disney World, really? <laughs> That's funny. Um, but, okay, let's take a look at the Three Little Pigs house, shall we? Uh, Sav and Selena Morgan, thank you for the subs, by the way. Um, go to Six Flags over Texas during winter. You can ride roller coasters over and over again. Really? I went to, um, I went to Thorpe Park. That's, that's a theme park in the UK. Um, in October on like a weekday. And during the day, it was incredible. Me and Dan went on every ride twice. Like we just walked straight onto them all because there was nobody there. At nighttime, because they had like a Halloween event going on at nighttime, it was busy. But during the day, walk straight on. It was great. Um, I loved that. That doesn't happen around here <laughs> in Florida. That does not happen here. <laughs> um, this is the three little pigs houses. 
There was once three little pigs who made their houses to live in. One made his out of hay, the other out of sticks, and the last made his with brick. <laughs> That's such a fun idea. Um, did you do this too, Gaming Sissy? Really? I think I saw a couple people say they built something like this, which is kind of fun. Um, okay. Um, let's go in. Thorpe Park is so good. Yeah, I had fun at Thorpe Park. Um, I, I really enjoyed going to Thorpe Park. I thought it was fun. <laughs> um, all right. Let's take a look. Steve! <laughs> Steve, it's a llama! Yes! <laughs> they got llamas! Um, okay, I don't know if he's still here, but that's really funny. <laughs> Um, so we have this a beautiful pathway in the main front of the building. Over here we have the house made of straw, which is so cute, by the way. So cute. Um, I've got this little bedroom. I love the pink wallpaper, a little bathroom right here. Do you know what this reminds me of? This is maybe perhaps a niche reference, but it, it's, it's just because it's like more than one house on the same big lot. But does anybody remember the four immortal sisters challenge in the sims 4 because you used to have to have like four houses for each of them that's what this reminds me of yeah <laughs> i know a lot of you might remember a lot of you might not but um picture like the, i forget the exact rules of the challenge but like there's like four sisters and they had different jobs and they each had a house and um, that's what this reminds me of. <laughs> Except this one is, is pigs and not, um, special sims. Uh, this is the house made of sticks. Inside we got all the wood accents everywhere. Um, oh, I love this with the loft too. Yeah, the fire, earth, water, and air ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then over here we have the brick one with all the red. This is such a cool idea. Um... Oh yeah, the general idea of the challenge is that four sisters care for and teach skills to the children of the fire sister while also sacrificing other sims to the cow plant so that they can be immortal and never age <laughs> up. Oh my god, when you say it like that, it sounds ridiculous. But that's the rules of the challenge, yeah. Um, <laughs> and they each have their own house and they each have their own things they're supposed to do. You had me at sacrifice? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> people used to do that challenge a lot on YouTube like back honestly when like like when I was starting YouTube or like before I started YouTube like early Sims 4 days that was that was being played a lot like 2015 yeah um the good days <laughs> Ashley comfy thank you for the subs by the way yeah back in the olden days all right let's go to the next one uh I closed it by accident okay I'm back I'm back Okay, only Mirage is the next one, and their username is Lost Paradise. Yeah, before we had toddlers, to put it into some context, that was pre-toddlers. Um. Yeah, oh, you only Mirage, yeah. <laughs> the modern getaway. Are you kidding? This looks so good. I hate round walls. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, okay, okay, so we have this out in Sulani. That looks so good. I love this. Um, what size lot was it? Oh shoot, I think I need to evict these people. Goodbye. Time to be evicted. Oh, I'm lost. Come back. Uh-oh. Okay. Come on, game. You can do it. 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 Oh, dear. Okay, you did it. Filter by newest. There we go. You did it. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> uh, Fang and Brindleton, thank you for the subs, by the way. Um, you did it, game. You made it. You should be so proud of yourself. <laughs> Okay, anyway, here we have 
this amazing build. Look at the landscaping. Oh, I love this garage they've got down here too. It's fake, but it looks really cool. <laughs> Um, and then you go up the stairs in the front. We've got this amazing pool and like yard space. We have this green roof with the solar panels. And then inside we have this amazing kitchen. And then we have this beautiful living room. I love the color scheme. Also this tile, this is new from the high school pack. Um, it's got some like kind of fun other swatches too, but the white looks really good as a kitchen backsplash. Um, that's a really good, a good option. We have this big bathroom too. Look at the view with the plants. Oh. And then in here we have this little pink bedroom. I love this house. They probably bought this car from the dealership from earlier. <laughs> I really like it though. I think it looks really good. Um, I just have so much fun with these. The rocks are always so cool. People do the, like the raised up terrain and everything. Oh, stunning. I like the black as well. I don't know. It just looks really good. It's very nice. Okay, let's go on to the next one. The next one is Val Crushed Bones. Thank you very much. You can do basements in The Sims 4, Ty. Um, you've been able to do basements for a long time. <gasps> Converted grain silo. Oh my god. Joanna Gaines who? <laughs> Um, it's a converted grand style with an open plan living area, two bedrooms, one bathroom, a painting studio. Iconic. This is in Oasis Springs. Is Joanna Gaines from your hometown, really, Tank? That's pretty funny. Um. <laughs> oh yeah, you can't do basements in Sulani. That's right, you can't do basements in Sulani. The, I mean, in their defense, you can't do basements in real life Florida because our water table is too high, so I suppose it checks out in Sulani, so... Um. <laughs> okay, here's the grain silos. They also bought this truck from the, the shop from earlier. Um, <laughs> in the back, we've got this amazing pool. Oh, look at that. The like sunken hangout space with the grill and the table and the cover over it with these lights and everything. This is so pretty. I think this backyard looks so cool. I love the idea of this build and they did it three stories. I couldn't do mine that big. I was too stressed. Oh, the floor plan looks so cool with the big just open living and the, the ladder up. Okay, upstairs we've got a couple bedrooms and a bathroom and then another ladder up to a giant art studio. Oh, that's so cool. This one would be so fun to play in. It's like so fun to live in. I, I'm gonna call it weird, but I don't mean like weird, you know, but it's, it's fun to live in like weird places that aren't just like your like average house, you know? It's it like, it's a really interesting spot to have your Sims be. This is really cool. It's quirky. Yeah, but like in a good way. <laughs> it's just a fun idea. I really like this. That's so cool. That's so cool. No llamas though, so. <laughs> <laughs> um, Oscar and Allie, thank you for the subs, by the way. Uh, that's really, really fun. Okay, the next one is History Chick 96. I have a history degree. Me and you are the same. <laughs> okay, come on. Okay, it loaded. Welcome back. I have a circle house. Show me. Rooftop lounge area and hot tub pit. Except this made me never want to build or decorate a circle house ever again. <laughs> I like how so many people's descriptions start off with like, this is the worst thing that has ever happened to me. I will never ever do a circle room again. <laughs> Everybody starts off with like, I hated every second of this. <laughs> it's really funny. I'm really sorry. See someone in the chat just finished the shell. It was very painful. <laughs> I'm so sorry. What have I done? <laughs> I feel like our cute little community project is actually just misery. 
you know? <laughs> I didn't do this one because I didn't want to hate myself after. Do you know what? I actually liked doing mine. I thought it was alright. I thought mine was fun. I didn't think it was too, too bad. It wasn't too, too good either, but it wasn't too, too bad. <laughs> Oh, look at the back. Oh my goodness. I love that like sunken fire pit. That looks really cool. Fire pit? I meant hot tub pit. That's the opposite, isn't it? <laughs> that just, it looks cool though. I like that idea. I like the rooftop space as well. It's just nice to have extra space up there. Are there ads playing? Oh God. <sighs> That's mean. The lighting glitches are so annoying. This is just the fault of the curved walls though, but the lighting glitches are so annoying too. Very, very, very annoying. Very, very, very annoying. Is this base game only someone asked? Um, I'm not sure. Let's find out. Come on. Hello, I lost it. Oh no, baby Simsy's in a bad mood. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Quite the message. <laughs> oh, Spade Kelly, thank you for the subs. Let's check. Circle, circle. Oh, I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm lost. Oh no. I can't check if it's base. Okay, I can. Newest. Circle. Base game. Yes, it is base game. All right, there we go. <laughs> I tried, I tried. Let's go on the inside then. Oh, look, they've got it lofted too. Pride flag. Bedroom. Lofted like art studio. And then downstairs. I love this like main staircase in the middle. And we've got like the dining space to the right. The kitchen over here. And then we have this bathroom right here and this living room over here. This is a really nice layout. Two pride flags in the build. This looks really nice. I really, really enjoy this. What a fun idea. I think the backyard is good too. This one has just like so many useful items as well. It's so hard like to fit in things like this sometimes like gym equipment and a hot tub and a bar and like a, you know, with telescope, like there's just so many things that you want your Sims to have just to like function, <laughs> but it's kind of hard to fit them in, but it's nice. This one has space for everything. It's really good, really well done, like functional build, you know? Okay, let's do another one, shall we? Uh, the next one is going to be Rachy Pat on the gallery. Okay, okay. <laughs> Come on. Load. Simsy Circle Shell Challenge. What is this one? A cute little house for a single mom and her smart, overachieving daughter. Oh, I like the green front door. That's already speaking to me. I'm already into it. Okay, it's on a 20 by 20. Maybe I'll put it out here. We're not going in order of entries, no mermaid. We're doing, we're picking them randomly. Um, trying to give people as much of an equal shot as we can. Um, only problem is, uh, <laughs> obviously there's a lot of people that have entered and not a lot of time in the day. So we try our best to get through as many as we can, but we can't always do them all. Um, okay, anyway, I love this blue, like the teal mint color. I keep forgetting that the new high school pack has like so many good, like minty swatches. This is so good for Not So Berry. Like for the first gen of Not So Berry, that's like perfect. Perfect. Oh no, Simmer Crossing, you can only do it once per day. If you left and came back, you're still in the list. Don't worry. There's like a lot of people in the list though. <laughs> but the door just looks so good. It just looks so good. Um, and then when you come inside, we have this little like kitchen dining area. A little living room through the door over here with the TV on the wall. We've got this little bathroom with the wallpaper. We got a kid's room with some cute rugs and things. And look, their overachieving daughter has like a million ribbons because they won like everything. <laughs> Um, and then in here we've got the main bedroom with the yellow accents. This is a really cute one. I love the mint. The, I can't get over this. I just kind of forgot those even existed. So I, I'm like, hmm, <laughs> I should take notes on that one because that's a really good swatch. 
Um, okay, anyway. Emmy and Emspade, thank you for the subs, too. Is that an eco floor? Um, no, this one is from, from, a, uh, I almost said Oasis Springs. Outdoor Retreat. It's from Outdoor Retreat. This is the Granite Falls wood flooring. Um, it's supposed to be kind of, like, cabiny. If I put it in that color, it might make more sense, but... It's really pretty for this house. I like the light color a lot. It's really nice. Yeah, the egg rug is new. The egg on toast rug is new from the high school pack. So is that one. It's a good one. Um, any rooftop piranhas this afternoon? No, there's not been any piranhas today, honey bear. A surprising lack of piranhas. Um, it's really upsetting. Yeah. <laughs> Summer, thank you for the three months. Okay. Let's pick the next one. Can I just say also, chat, I don't mean to alarm you, but I started feeling like really sick all of a sudden. <laughs> so I don't know how much longer I'm gonna be live for. All of a sudden I'm like, mm, maybe I'm not doing so hot today. <laughs> um, but I still, I don't wanna stop touring builds, but also I'm like, hmm, should I continue to be watched by 3000 people? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I was supposed to stream twice today too. Oh God. Okay, let's do another one. Wish me luck. This one is Samantha Power Flicks, and their origin ID is Defire Over. We've had two bad luck days with these shell tours, huh? Um. <laughs> Come on. No, Fod, you don't actually need piranhas in the pond to kill Sims. They just drown. So you don't, it doesn't matter if you've got anything in there. Um, but you can pretend. Welcome to Stanley Humphrey's Res Wed Calf Bar. It's a restaurant, a wedding venue, a bar, and a cafe. It's a four-in-one circle venue. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's actually so fun. Just can't decide? Do it all. <laughs> can't choose? Why not everything? I'm lost. I'll put it over here. <laughs> we love a functional lot, right? You can literally do anything with it. <laughs> Can't choose? Just don't. That's really fun though. I like how it's for Stanley Humphrey as well. Oh my God, you weren't kidding. Okay, so on the bottom floor, it's like all the wedding stuff. <laughs> it's everything you need for a wedding venue all set up on the bottom floor. And then you walk inside, it's the restaurant. You go upstairs, there's more restaurant. Up upstairs, there's a bar. And up up upstairs, there's a cafe. <laughs> there's like some bathrooms over here. Um, very golden. I can't believe you made it this tall. And what is that? <laughs> it's really cool. It's just kind of fun. I like I like the shape a lot. I really particularly enjoy um the fact that the bathrooms are floating, if it's very Stanley Humphrey. I feel like the the hot dog would flourish here, as as uh, Jenny has said in chat. Um, yeah, it just feels right, you know? Yeah, I like the bathrooms are over the wedding too. It's just nice because the toilets are right here, so you'd be here like exchanging your vows and then you just hear like flushing upstairs. <laughs> Constantly you just hear the flushing. <laughs> oh! Where does the plumbing go? Um. Right under the arch. <laughs> I think that's so fun. I it, to me I love, like, minor chaos things in The Sims, where, like, obviously that's not real, but you can pretend it is and it's funny. In the similar sense, it's hilarious to me to put, like, glass doors into a bathroom. Like, imagine for a second, there's, like, a toilet right here. And instead of that door, it's just, like, solid glass. Because your Sim doesn't care. They won't know. But we know. And it's funny. <laughs> I just like it. I just think a little bit of chaos is a uh, fun on your Saturday afternoon, you know? 
Okay, nice going, stupid person. Um, hey mods, you can probably report that account. It'll probably get banned. So, um, just so you all know, it's really, I know you're trolling, but you might want to be careful about the kind of trolling that you do because when you do things that are TOS, your account will get deleted on Twitch. Like not just banned, like we'll delete, we'll, we'll report you and they'll delete you. So keep it up. <laughs> um, anyway, <laughs> Kai, thank you for the 38 month reset, by the way. Um, I think I might do, uh, I think I might do like one more. And then to be honest, besties, I'm not doing so hot right now. <laughs> I don't feel good right now, so I might get off stream and go lay down, to be honest. Um, this is very not good timing. Um, I will let you know, <laughs> but I think I might do one more and then go lay down. <laughs> All right, last one, last one then. Dancer Emma 16 Builds by Emma. No, we've... D Did we tour one of yours for a video, Builds by Emma? I feel like we might have. Oh, Stanley. <laughs> yeah, we did this one. We toured this one on, on stream and in the video. Oh, and this one. We put this in the video last time too. Oh, this is actually probably a good one to end on then. Um, This is very fun. Modern Lakeside Treehouse. Simsy Circle Shell. Be one with nature in this modern treehouse retreat. Enjoy the private beach, fishing pond, fire pit, or simply stargaze on the roof. Yeah, the luck of this. Well, I mean, I didn't tour this on stream, I don't think. Or maybe I did. Did I put that in a video? I don't remember. This one was in the video, though. For sure. Um, time to buy a lottery ticket. Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, let's go place this in Granite Falls. Just the loft? Okay. Not the winery, just the loft. Okay, it was just once then. Not twice. <laughs> it was just the one, not, not twice. Um, I recognize it though. <laughs> so it's just... Oh, it's 40 by 30. Okay, I was like, where's, why isn't it there? <laughs> Where did it go? I put it on the wrong lot size. That was my bad chat. Um, let's go place this over here then. Furnished. <laughs> um. Okay, now we are here. The confusion on my face was hilarious. Yeah, I bet. I don't know. I did it on the wrong one. There's a tree growing through the house. That is so cool. The pond underneath the whole place. The private beach that you made by the water. Oh my god. That is so cool. We have this little like outdoor seating area dock thing. Wait. Oh, they use signs to make it look like the bench had like um, edges to it. That's pretty smart. Built in grill. And then on the inside of the house, well, one, we've got this amazing rooftop and you can actually access half of it. And there's some chairs and some telescopes and stuff. And then inside you walk in and we have this amazing, no, this living space is so cool. This, this looks so good. Like the, the fireplace with the custom thingy in it, that's a coffee table. I can't pick it up though. Cause it's, curved walls. I <laughs> just, woo, doesn't let me. Um, oh, I ruined it. I ruined it. I ruined the curved walls. Oh my God. What did I do? <laughs> the floor's gone. Oh, the curved walls are so broken. This isn't their fault. It's just the game. The curved walls are gone and <laughs> I've deleted the floor. I broke it. <laughs> I broke it. I can't put it back. <laughs> oh, I'm back. Okay. Sorry, I false alarm. The fireplace is still gone, but that's fine. And here we've got a really fancy bathroom. And we also have this beautiful bedroom um, attached. I love Granite Falls. Can I be honest? I think Granite Falls is one of my favorite places in, in all of The Sims. I have like such a nostalgia for Granite Falls and for Outdoor Retreat. I don't think it's like the best game pack. 
I think there's ones that are more worth the money. But I really, like, have a sort of attachment to Granite Falls. Because it was, like, the first pack. And I, I remember I, like, skipped my freshman homecoming. And I uh, played The Sims 4. And I downloaded the Granite Falls. And we played Gra Granite Falls. And then Outdoor Retreat, we played it. It was really fun. So I have a lot of, like, love in my heart for this pack. Same as um, City Living. Uh, I have similar vibes toward that one. Not for the same reasons, but I just have a lot of love for City Living. It takes me back. It's fun. <laughs> so, um, anyway, this house is beautiful. All your builds today have been so beautiful. Thank you all for like letting me um, tour them on stream. It's really fun to get a chance to do this. Um, we've done two of these streams now, and both of them were short. So I guess that uh, counts as being one full one. Right? <laughs> I think I might get off stream though, because I really started not feeling good, and I I want to go lay down. So <laughs> I think I might leave. <laughs> Um, I'll be back on Monday. If not, I'll be back later tonight too, but we'll see how that goes. Um, I'll be back on Monday because we're going to play with the Potts family, not so very on Monday. Um, that is the plan. That is the plan. I'll do a video touring the shells on YouTube next weekend. I think I'm going to post it like next Saturday. Um, so we'll do that next weekend as well. So I also didn't post on YouTube today because I recorded this morning and then I was like, mm, I'm not going to record tomorrow. So I, I'm going to post the video I made today tomorrow instead. <laughs> But this morning, I was like, mm, I'm gonna pack tomorrow, not record, so I'm just gonna skip today's upload. <laughs> today's been a flop, let's be honest. I'm gonna go find someone to raid, I think. Um, thank you all for hanging out. I'll refund all your points, by the way. Um, I always reject all the ones, all the requests that I didn't get to. Right, Oops. Um, so, you should get the points back. It's only 99, but you should get them back. Um, thank you all again for hanging out tonight, like I said. Um, but Dan's playing another random game. What is he doing? <laughs> okay. Anyway, I'm not gonna raid him again. I raided him yesterday. <laughs> um, I think I'm gonna raid my friend Shella. Oh, maybe I shouldn't. She's leaving the Sims unpaused. I always wonder, I always wonder if it's like, a good idea or not to raid a friend's unpaused stream because it's like I don't want to I don't want to cause chaos in in your stream when you're not there I just saw her moving the camera so she is probably there but I always feel like is it wrong I don't know everyone has to be really nice to Shella okay but she's leaving The Sims on pause right now. So she's got, like, basically this, like, nightmare build, Death Trap. Um, and it looks like all of her mods are in the house. Um, and everyone's dying. <laughs> so, I, last I heard from her this morning, I think she said that there were six kids born. Um, in the unpaused stream. Which is, uh, really something else. Oh, not all of her- Fod, she's got more than just enough- just enough to have in the house. I think she did, like, a random draw. I was in her last unpaused stream and I died, so. Anyway, say hi to her for me. I'm gonna run, um, because I don't feel good. And I'm gonna see you all, uh, later, okay? I love you. I miss you already. Uh, be very nice, not chaotic. I'm serious. Don't embarrass me. Um, and I'll see you all in a bit, okay? Okay. Goodbye!